Welcome students, uh, today we are going to see the difference between formal and informal assessment, okay? To get started, formal assessment refers to the standardized tests that are made by a country, by a group of country, countries that want to measure um, specific skills in their students. For example, in Colombia, before going to the university, we have to take the ICPEX that is known by every person in Colombia. And that's a standard test because it's a schedule, it has some parameters, and it wants to measure some abilities in their students. On the other hand, uh, another example from the standard test is the PISA. Since Colombia was part of the OCD, ECD, um, Colombia has been requested to send students to take part of this of this test that is provided to the members of that organization. It was some kind of controversial because we didn't uh, get, we didn't achieve the lower levels that are required in that test. That one is also a standard, a formal test. On the other hand, we have the informal that refers to all quizzes, oral presentations, um, that are, that are requested by the teacher in the classroom. Um, they could could or couldn't be scheduled and they don't necessarily have uh, standard parameters. Uh, if, this, if the teacher wants to check some receptive skills, he can make a written t quiz. And uh, if the teacher wants to check productive skills, he can definitely make an oral presentation, but that necessarily doesn't have a standards or are required to, to for the country, for an organization. No, it's just for the teacher in the classroom. Okay. Um, okay, students, I hope you have understood the difference between formal and informal assessment.